My name is Diana Santiago and I work in the ceramic branch from NASA Glenn Research Center. I grew up in the south part of Puerto Rico. Um, since I was a child, I always wanted to come to NASA, to work in NASA, but that was like a dream. But then when I was doing uh, graduate school, my advisor uh, told me to apply for a NASA leadership internship. And I didn't know that I could have the opportunity to apply for that internship, and I did. And I came t uh, here um, two summers in a row, and, and I fell in love with the. I am a research materials engineer, and I'm working with two different groups. One of the groups is the solid oxide fuel cell, and the other one is the nanomaterial group from the ceramic branch. We are uh, creating here with the fuel cells a very unique uh, device that is a very lightweight uh, that could be used in, for airplanes uh, and also ca can be used uh, for space application because of the lightweight. Um, also uh, with the nanomaterials, uh, one of the properties of the nanomaterials that we are preparing is that it's an insulator. It's one of the best insulators that exist and we can use that uh, material as a separator of the electrodes of a supercapacitor to keep the charge in place. And that, that is one of the applications. For me, uh, working in NASA is very exciting because I had the opportunity to learn many things every day. Um, I'm not uh, stuck with just my background research. I have been uh, learning new topics uh, to keep proposing new areas, um, develop new areas, and that is very exciting. The National Hispanic Month celebration means a lot to me. For example, I am part of the Hispanic advisory group here at NASA Glen. Um, in this group, uh, we make many activities uh, per year uh, to recognize the contribution to our nation of, of the Hispanic community around here, the area, or nationwide. One of the person that inspired me uh, when I was young, it was my math teacher. Uh, she was a very tough uh, teacher with all the students, but she always keep us, like encouraging us to to be working and practicing in, in our math uh, homeworks. And she always said that uh, practice make perfect. And that is my dean still today.